And we are back with the beginning. Oh, you know what? I didn't change the fucking game we're streaming, though. <laughs> no, I forgot a le step. So, let's fix this. PlayStation 3! Lego, uh, Lego Belch. <laughs> the weirdest of the Lego games. <laughs> I regret nothing. I'm Batman! <laughs> there we go. There we go. That's how I wanted to start this off with. <laughs> yes. Hello, Commissioner. It's good to see you again. I'm, I'm staring at this can of Coke Life that I'm Smooth. drinking. Smooth. Yep. I love Blue Beetle. When he runs around, he just says, The Scarab says you're so. <laughs> Jaime Reyes. Yeah, Blue in... Beetle. I am, I am very much of the opinion that we need the real Jaime Reyes back, the one from the earliest comics. Because you know what's fun about the first time you play with Jaime Reyes? No. Uh, okay, actually, you know what I'm going to do is I am going to go to continue... Jaime is the best. Jaime is the best. Jaime uh, is the best. In the original comic, there's a bit where Eclipso shows up, right? Mm -hmm. And Eclipso has this thing where she makes you fight the worst possible version of yourself. Like, she's used it on Superman and pulled out a super despot. Um, she's used it on Batman and pulled out a power-hungry control freak. You said on Jaime Reyes, she got a slightly sadistic dentist <laughs> who just liked to take summers off in Cancun. <laughs> like, this is the worst you have? Well, yeah. Where's your ambition? Uh, I'm a dentist. I make six figures a year <laughs> and have a summer home in Cancun down the street from my grandma's. I love you, Jaime. It's like, Jaime is awesome. And while Eclipso's standing there just in a daze. Just in a goddamn daze about what's going on. Uh, that's when Brenda, sh Brenda and Paco show up and just hit her upside the head with a stick. <laughs> they take down the demigod with a stick. So, uh, we're not doing the story mode for Batman like we did for Sneak King, for lack of a better term. Um, what we are doing is we are collecting villains. That's adorable. And we will be collecting villains for a little bit. Join me, Art. Some of that artwork we cannot put on a stream. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, a lot of this artwork we can't put on a stream. Right. It's why I haven't been streaming the art I've been doing. Uh, we want. I intend to fix cackle. that. I don't know if I like this Coke Life thing. Is it? No, no. You can get a normal Coke after this. Behold, no, the I Robin can't. Mobile. I took the last one. Oh, I'm sorry. Do we have any Mountain Dews left? I don't know. Oh, there's no but Mountain Dew box then. Here, I miss box. Oh, oh god. Well, so no there's idea. a plot point in this game where Lex Luthor creates an anti-black brick machine. So all of the black bricks go away? No, they just dissolve. Oh no. So uh, Batman creates a Robin-colored Batmobile. Oh my god. Here's my question though. Oh, Skippy. He doesn't. He doesn't get the the rainbow Batman suit. No. Because it's not black bricks, it just looks like them. Skippy uh, needs to find a collection of Jaime. Teleport is cool. Jaime is Bay. Uh, what does Bay stand for? Before all else. I, uh, yeah. Are those birthday cakes? Yes. Why are people just randomly running around with birthday cakes? Behold the best Robin costume. Acrobat suit. Oh my god. Dick, you are so <laughs> And that's what makes this clearly Dick as yeah. Robin, by yeah. the way. Whee! Oh my god, Dick. Seriously. <laughs> uh... uh perhaps my favorite uh Teen Titans panel of all time. Dick Dick, I love Dick. <laughs> Followed by <laughs> Beast Boy going, Yeah, I'm sure you do. <laughs> And it's one of those moments where you go, Marv Wolfman knew damn well what he was doing. Yep. <laughs> Marv Wolfman was great. I miss him. He's still around. Yeah. He still is. I mean, he was great. He sucks lately. No. Um, <laughs> no, Marv's fun. Uh, I got to meet him when we went to WonderCon. <gasps> I met him too! Yeah. He was great! Nice guy. Real nice guy. Uh, I mean, some of the creators I met didn't, were not the nicest when I met them. I'm not going to say names. I figured they just had a rough day. Marv Wolfman clearly did not have a rough day. Now, is Marv the best writer in the world? God, no. 
But he, says, he has fun. He has fun with it. Uh, there are times he gets creepy as shit, though. Yeah. Although I can appreciate that on, on some level. Making Donna Making Troy Donna marry a guy who looks just like him. No. With the excuse of it's okay because it's her college professor. No. But this is the other reason I love the dick, the acrobat suit for Dick. <laughs> it gives you the hamster ball power up. That is so great. Right. <laughs> Robin should use this more often. Yes. Best Whee! balancer from Batman when they use ejaculate to mean yelling. Oh yeah. Dick, I can't have you ejaculating everywhere. <laughs> well, <laughs> that's what he's best at. <laughs> Now, I just want a comic Disco of... Disco Nightwing is so fun. I just want a comic of nothing but Beast Boy reacting to 1960s vocabulary. <laughs> or like modern day Beast Boy. Yeah. <laughs> Except no, that's not true. I want classic Beast Boy. Right? But knowing modern day slang. Yes! I think the closest we've gotten to that is cartoon Beast Boy. Ugh, except yeah. he's not nearly as crude. Not hitting the... I wasn't trying to. Yeah. Um, it's just all chaos. Oh, because the city's in chaos. Uh, dogs and answer. cats living together. Mass <laughs> hysteria, people! <laughs> I can't wait for Young Justice. Oh, I know, me too! I'm so excited! Is and, that a second Batman? And he just can't yes. hide it. What? Do I want to buy a clown goon? Yes. What a... Now I am the clown. Oh no. No, I'm not the clown yet, but what Why? I will be doing... Why are there two Batmans? Because I accidentally selected Batman when I was trying. How do I pull that menu back up? God dang it. No. I want... To pull up the menu and play Cyborg for a bit. Uh, cyborg! Uh, show game controls. Oh. Hold to pick any character. Yes. Huh? Yeah! Here we go, so... It looks lovely. Let's play Cyborg mm. for a little bit. Yay! Uh, you know what? So Cyborg has a laser eye. Awesome! <laughs> Getting all the people. Kill villains, but you can't kill civilians. Oh, yeah, there was a heart. <gasps> Did Cyborg get broke? Yes. Here, let's switch to the Flash. Woo! Look at us go! <laughs> this this is the fun part: is the free play areas like yeah. this, especially after you've unlocked a couple characters. Yeah. Because then it's just woo. Phew. That's the Green Hornet. It is Flight of the Bumblebee. Thank you very much. Uh, the Green Hornet theme is the Flight of the Bumblebee. It is. <laughs> or at least has the Flight of the Bumblebee mixed into it. It's a jazz rendition called The Flight of the Green Hornet. <laughs> Whoa. You ran, ran into a wall. Whoa. That's I had cool. A bump. We can go up a building. Oh. Green bricks, we need to be Green Lantern. Yeah! Yeah. Oh my god, I love Hell Other times I hate him. I just killed Batman. <laughs> Sorry, Batman. Come here, fuckers! Leave me alone! I just want to build Let my me rocket! build the green bricks into a green rocket that can fly to a green moon. There we go. They killed Green Lantern. I mean, sometimes I like Hal Jordan, and other times I'm like, oh, you dick. <laughs> I'm much more of a Guy Gardner fan. What's going on in chat? Uh, Hal is a fucking asshole, bring, bring back Kyle. Uh, you know, you know what bothers me? Or John. The, the Green like Lantern John. in, John uh... Okay, a bit Honestly, of a give, ass, but... give Skippy both. The one in Injustice, <laughs> that move set, that that super move should be the one for. Mm, you know what? I wonder if Green Lantern will help me with this yellow cage. Probably not. There may <laughs> be problems with Injustice, but at least they don't give you. Do <laughs> I feel like 
think Skippy's a little hung up on Injustice. <laughs> I, uh, it's a fantastic game. Yeah, I know. Why we streamed it on Tuesday. What superhero I want to play? Uh, ah! Break a sword! Not quite doable. I know. I just wish. Because Freakazoid is awesome. Great. You know who I think is cool? You know what the best part of this is? Hmm. Even though it's the Batman theme, it's only true until you switch to Superman. And then it's the Superman. And when you fly, it switches. Da da da. Da 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 da. Da da da. Sue me. Um, I am playing it right now. Sue me. <laughs> I'm not Zooey, I'm just, I'm just saying, you sound like you're, you're really enjoying it. Get in the you big fiery oaf, I couldn't care less what you spell, I take orders from only I, I thought you've seen John Williams as the man. <laughs> that Did is the not? best no. ever. What suit is that? Magnet suit. Oh my god. This is actually a leftover from the last game. Oh no, Dick. Dick. We lost Dick. Oh, I'm damn it. Up, up, up. Boop, boop, boop. Boop. Like, I'm gonna put this out there. I love the 90s uh, DC cartoons. It's what made yeah. me love DC in the first place. Cause I didn't really grow up in a very geeky household. I mean, my mom hated anything basically that was like anything her sister was into. And her sister was into basically all the nerdy stuff. So my mom was like vehemently against it. And I included comic books. So like, That's most unfortunate. Yeah, I mean I read I read Calvin and Hobbes and Farside growing up, but I mean I wasn't like superhero comics. I got introduced to superheroes through the DC cartoons and, and the Marvel cartoons growing up. And the DC ones were always better. Yeah, DC tends to own TV. Like, Nothing I, against Marvel's TV department. Yeah. They are filled with many talented writers, and that's all I'm going to say about that. Yeah, it was about but, to say. Um, I will say, though, that DC kind of knows how TV works better. And well, they I was have say, for years. Uh, Marvel's gotten much better in the live in the live action TV department. Oh, yeah, but when it comes to cartoons. Yeah, cartoons, no, no, no contest. DC always does better. With one exception. Oh. You know the one. Here's the thing. Teen Titans Go, if you took out the Teen Titans and you turned it into a, a Metal Man show yeah. or a Doom Patrol show even... It would be a good show. It would be a fantastic show. But it's Teen Titans or hell, Go. You know who'd be the best one for it? Huh. Inferior Five. Yeah, that would be okay. The Inferior Five are a DC hero group that are just the worst. They um, are. <laughs> like, I shouldn't be that mean about it, but here we are. Now, don't get me wrong, I love the Inferior Five for what they are. But they have a character in it named Dumb Bunny. <laughs> so that should give you a pretty good idea about what kind of show you're dealing with. I need with. to see the Lego Batman movie. The F-list villains showing up geeks. <sighs> Excuse me. So we're now in Hazmat Robin. <laughs> awesome. I think Robin got the better bonus suits. Back to Magnet Robin. Oh, yes. Bad. Something fun. We have to switch to cyborg for it, though. I think this is a cyborg thing. Yep. Cyborg loves to build things. Ooh. Vicky Vale. Yes. Yes. Vicky Vale. Who's Vicky Vale? That is the girl who was Batman's girlfriend, basically Batman's Lois, mm -hmm. for years. Oh my God! Did I love Vicky Vale? And I'm still pissed off that. Yeah, I'm just pissed off about They've kind her. of erased her in favor of Bat, uh, Catwoman sense. lately. Thankfully not Batwoman, who, and this is still always my funniest thing. Skippy says Marvel sold their team. It's true, they did. Mm. See, had a... That's that true. That is true. Uh, and, and I, the problem is, is like, the animated, like the animated stuff that, that Marvel puts out, it's mm -hmm. not great. Not, it, it's it's okay for what it is, but it's not great. And 
I gotta say, I really enjoy every single DC animated film I've ever seen. I don't think I've ever found a DC animated mm. film that I don't like yet. Okay, Killing Joke I'm not fond of. I haven't seen it yet, so I don't want to make any judgments. I've heard some bad shit about it, though. Okay. Uh, Gods and Monsters, I think, was kind of... I loved it. So I know much. you loved it. So good! <laughs> I personally thought they could have used another actual Justice League movie before giving us one of those. Whatever! I thought it was great! I'm not denying it was good. I just... Eh. It was okay. Um, I think... I do like that they started doing the other universes with it. Um, when it comes to other universes, though, I really prefer, uh, what was it? Uh, the, the one with the crime syndicate. Eh. Um, but then again, I'm just fond of the crime syndicate. Yeah. Uh, I, I really like DC and I, Gods and Monsters because it's, it goes in a completely different direction than you're used to. Yeah, I'm... I can see that. And I was about to say, I just prefer it when the alternate versions are the same person, but under different circumstances. But even that's not entirely true. Yeah. Because uh, I do really like you, the Justice you just Society. Like, you just like, Skippy Look, says, the new got... DC animated film dive in quality, Gods and Monsters was amazing. You, you shut, shut up your face. Like... Yeah, Skippy, yeah, I'm right there with you. They got Bruce Timm to make a movie again and took the first opportunity to get... Yeah. Oh my god. No, I love- there's like- there's nothing I don't love about that- that movie. And I love the- the comic books that they tied in with it, because, like... I love- I love the new Wonder Woman, because she's like, yeah, I like sex. But also, if I say no, bitch, it's not happening. <laughs> I'm like, that is far more feminist than the type of, like, regular Wonder Woman they try- they try to push on you as being the feminist. Wonder Woman! Well, Wonder Woman herself is very feminist. When she's written by a good author. Yes, but she like it's been such a long time. Like I I haven't found well written Wonder Woman. It is. Uh, there hasn't been. It's been Greg Greco lately. Yeah, so like the the new the Gods and Monsters version. Love her, and it's not just because she's a redhead. Although that it, I am so biased. I'm fairly certain that factors into it. It does factor in. I'm not I'm not gonna lie. It does factor into it, but. I like that she has a different kind of backstory. I like how it's not like, uh, I don't need men until I do need men, or like, that kind of crap. It's, it's like, eh, men are, men are pretty cool. Well, she, that, that one's because that she didn't grow up on Paradise Island. Yeah. She grew up on New Genesis. Yeah, I know, but like, then, but then in the comics, they have this whole, um, plotline of her in the 60s. And her joining the the, the hippie, hippie movement, and then she's like, they say that these earth that these earth mothers are equal, but are equals, but they're not. And <laughs> then she goes off and starts her own woman like matriarch controlled little society <laughs> in the in the in the sixties, and I'm like, yeah, and it's great. Um, and I also I also like the new version of Batman in that version where where he's an actual vampire. <laughs> Apparently, Batman and Superman are kinda maybe gay. Okay. Wonder Woman is sex positive and has ties to the new gods that makes them relevant again. Yeah, see, exactly. That's that's what I like. I like that she's sex positive without losing, without becoming like over sexualized. I like that. I like that. There's that like hint of maybe Superman and, and Batman are gay, but even more so than normal. And also, <laughs> I like that Superman speaks Spanish and, and actively has the attitude of, um, Legos! Hey, look, it's Peter! Hi, Hello, PR. brother! Uh, I, I like that uh, Superman kind of has the attitude of the disenfranchised. Which he's supposed to. Yeah, but... Even, even, and it's sad when Zod Superman's been more like the real Superman lately. Yeah. Than the real Superman. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> like, like, I just, like, I kind of like Spanish Superman. So like, every time he starts swearing in Spanish, I have little tiny fits of, yeah. <laughs> Short with Brainiac and Superman. It does, it did make me cry. And I'm like, I like this version of Superman so much. <laughs> like. Oh, we got a new ooh. follower. And it's Peter. It's Peter. Peter, were you not following us already? I don't think so. Jacques, sir. <laughs> Jacques. Because, like, I, I, I have a hard time liking. 
I, I'm, I'm on the other side. I love yeah. Superman. I know you do. I desperately love Superman. I know. It's just, I, I, I have a lot of problems. Well, what are they? What are your grievances? Uh, I don't like that, well, for one thing, that he's often, like, they often forget about, like, how he's super everything, which includes his freaking brain, and he doesn't freaking use it, so it's never, like, he's super intelligent. Uh, yeah. Peter, you are forgiven. Or it's, like, or it's, like, brought in specific, specifically for only just one moment. Yeah. And, and that's the he's, part- He's impulsive, which gets in the way. Yeah. And um, I, I- But even then- Yeah. I mean, yeah, he's not gonna be as smart as Lex or Mr. Terrific. The, the second one, not the first one. First one's an idiot. Um, that's not true. The first one's pretty smart. And I think another- and I think another part of it is, is like, I don't- like how it feels like he's the boy scout like he's holier than thou i don't like that especially when he uses a lot of violent means to get his to meet the ends there there are a couple writers who i think can get superman right i'm one of them no Uh, (laughs) no but there there are a couple writers who can definitely get superman right i'm not going to deny that the problem you run into with a lot of Superman writers, right? Yeah. Is they tend to see him as he was often written in Justice League. Yeah. Where he's the Boy Scout. So when you get a just a plain Superman story, he just comes off as an asshole. Yeah. Uh, or you get a bunch of people who were fans of Superman in the 70s, which is a bad time to be a fan of Superman. Yeah. Because you know what happened in the 70s for Superman? He had an editor... Who hated Superman. <laughs> who went, you know what would make the Superman guy a lot more interesting? If he wasn't Superman. So let's give this guy Bartok. Did Batman die? No, we, we're just going through the different characters. Yeah. So you had a guy who said that the hero of Superman's comic, and this was true for like a year, is not Superman. Lex Luthor. No. no. Bartok's the hyperman. What? Who yeah. has all of Superman's powers, but they're not super, they're hyper. Uh, oh, and instead of wearing a big S on his chest, oh hey, it's Deadshot. So we're gonna have a Deadshot boss fight now. Oh, it's Hush. Oh fuck. Never mind. <laughs> Is that even worse? He did like ten years ago for like ten minutes that he was back in time. <laughs> we did what Get now? Get your butt kicked, sir. <clears throat> uh oh. Back, go back. I'm trying to regain my footing. Oh. Oh. Leave? Yeah. This my chance. Oh, no, there he is. Okay. You had to start all over. Take two. Oh, here we go. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. What job? Oh, my God. Well, Batman's dead now. Don't oh, worry, no. though. He'll come the back. The origin of my favorite. Japanese superhero's power. Wonder Woman throwing her tiara. <laughs> okay, so now we can play as Hush. Awesome. You, you know, know who shouldn't write Batman? Mark Miller, because that shit was just a retelling of the nail. It was even better? This guy! Captain Marvel! I do like Captain Marvel. Well, Shazam? Yeah. Okay, so they have to call him Shazam and everything because Captain Marvel as we know him, this guy... Wait, wait, I want to check something. When I land on the ground and I press circle, do I get to summon a lightning bolt? I mean, he's called Captain Marvel in the in the, uh, the cartoon, but... Ooh, yeah. Okay, but anytime he shows up and they have to write his name, they can't write the word Captain Marvel. Because, so this is the Fawcett Comics Captain Marvel. Fawcett Comics got bought out by DC. Yep. But in the me- during the legal proceedings... What was the- his superpower again? Oh yeah, he's right. <laughs> No, that's Batman's. Uh, the trademark expired. And Timely Comics had just renamed themselves Marvel, Marvel. Comics. And they had bought the t- the, cop- uh, the trademark for Captain Marvel. There were already two characters named Captain Marvel out in the world. So, anyone publishing this Captain Marvel or the robot Captain Marvel <laughs> could not call the book Captain Marvel. They could not use those two words in that order, no matter how hard they try. <laughs> so because of this... I, I can't. 
There are. I know. I was looking at his cape for some reason. It's uh, blue and lightningy. Because of this, there are three characters named Captain Marvel, but only the alien one gets to actually be gets used. to actually be called Captain Marvel. Because anyone else being called Captain Marvel is in fact not Captain Marvel from a trademark standpoint. So this one is typically called Shazam after his magic word. Even though if he said that, he would immediately turn back into Billy Batson. Yeah. Shazam! And the other one is called That Robotic Marvel. I read that shit and was so disappointed when I found it was what Mark Miller would have done with Superman. I have no idea. What are you talking uh -oh. about? Silver bars. Okay, who gets silver? Heat vision's gold. Uh, who does silver? Is cold silver? But any Mr. Freeze or Captain Cold? Captain Cold. <laughs> Captain Cold's outfit is so. It's, <laughs> it's so much more thematically appropriate. I mean, it is, but it's also really stupid looking. And every time they try to redesign it, it looks worse. I know! It does! I've seen it, he like... He is an Eskimo! Like, I, I do... There's, like... I'm sorry, but... Goku in a blue suit! <laughs> Nightwing. There's this There's this one, uh... What is it? I think it's, uh... Batman and Superman, um... Uh... What's the one where they're, they're on the run, and they're, like... Because Luther's president, and they're... Oh, uh, Public Enemies. Yeah, Public Enemies. And and the style of that one, not all that great. Because everyone is blocky as I am the shit. one who knocks? Oh, God. Uh, Gibby was talking uh, about the Mark going. Miller. I mean, hush. DC was able to use Captain Marvel for a while, then Marvel snuck the rights out from under them again. <laughs> That's true. Kinda, yeah. Uh, can somebody look up what gets the silver ones? Yeah. I, for some reason, my laptop wasn't be able. It wasn't connected to the internet. Yeah. Okay, I'll look it up. Hold the controller. Lego. Open. Thank you. Get me. She's got her phone out. That's two. why I wasn't. Not hush. Huck. Oh, like 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 Huck uh, Huck. Like Huck Finn. Oh no, Skippy. Not hush. Huck. Try Superman. I haven't tried Superman yet. Twice the heat Silver. vision. <clears throat> or you just punch it. No, orange is punching. Silver bricks? Yeah. Read. God damn it, read my comment in order. Never. Sorry. I mean, we have been. Trying to skip. As we see it, it's just. There's three of us, and some of them don't see it, and then I have to repeat it. It makes sense in order. Sil silver blocks, like... Martian Hunter? Okay, so the question is, do any of you up the sparkly silver blocks, or do to do it? Oh yeah, what, response, who does bombs? The response is, everyone has explosive things, but they have to be at ground level. You can't launch power Batman. You can't... Uh, or it's power like, Batman! You can't launch them like Power Batman can, but you can make them hit some cages and stuff just not higher than you. So it's only Batman and Penguin? I like it. Shit. Seems a little bit difficult. I love the Martian Manhunter man. Martian Manhunter man! Shut up! Sorry. Like, I like him too. Martian Manhunter is... I love John Jones. Gold bricks! Uh oh. Just oh. launched a bomb into a crowded city square. <laughs> People are dead now. Yep. Hey, look, it's the Joker! He's your loading icon. Yep. There's nothing up here for me. It's feel impressive. 
Uh, like, I've only really liked two versions of Superman. Okay. Gods and Monsters and uh -huh. Earth One. Okay. Huck is a Mark Miller book from Image. It's what his take on Superman would have been, and he decided he would be a simple boy who helps this town until he gets outed. It was basically Elseworld, Elseworlds the nail, and it was fucking awful. Miller should not be given control of things because his original IPs. That sounds about right. Yeah. Uh, didn't sounds Mark Millar like also do the TV show Smallville? Smallville was awful. It was. I, I had a lot of friends who though. loved it. Um, I couldn't care less. Only me. You know what? Like you know what? You know what was a your you know what was a good was Superman just... TV show? What? Lois, Lois and Clark. Lois and Clark. <laughs> Lois and Clark is a wonderful version. Of I Superman. love that show. Kick Ass should never have gotten a sequel or a threequel or a movie. Uh, what, what was the other one? Uh, no, there's another one from Mark Millar. Mm -hmm. It's like, what the fuck were they thinking? Um, mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Okay, it's coming back to me. His version of Captain Marvel. Specifically, the lightning bolty one. Uh, do you want to know what his version of Captain Marvel is? Well, does it make me want to punch my eyes out? Maybe. <laughs> it's a little kid in a wheelchair, which already makes him basically Captain Marvel Jr., but okay. Uh... Who gets a wish from a monkey to turn into the character from the movie he just watched. Right? And it turns out the monkey is Satan. And it's pronounced Miller, it's just the Scottish spelling. I know how it's pronounced. I'm saying it Millar. Millar, fuck darling. Millar. <laughs> Milan. <but> Milan. <laughs> It's in the past, darling. I never look back. <laughs> she can't. She'll think of all the heroes she's killed. Shut God damn it! I just wanted her to do something fun, and then you have to go and make it dark. It's Pixar. They'll make it dark for you. Ten minutes in. Look at, <laughs> look at these lovely children. Oh, she's sterile. Now she's dead. No! Up was the most goddamn emotional movie. Listen to this wonderful Barbara Streisand song. Oh, the earth is gone. What? Da 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 Put on your Sunday clothes, there's lots of world out there! Like, I can't watch Hello, Dolly. I can't either. Probably for a different reason than you, though. Okay, I... I rewatched it again recently, and the whole time I'm hating it, and I'm like, why? This is actually really like, a fairly good film. And then I got to the end, I'm like, oh my god, I remember why I can't watch this movie. My stupid babysitter who would listen to K-Frog and nothing else, uh -huh. which ruined country music for me. Because so what are you doing? It, it, she would, when she wasn't playing K-Frog, uh -huh. um, she was playing Hello Dolly on repeat for months on end. Oh. And watching it. So it wasn't just that it was all the time in, in in the car. It was, we would get to the house, and then it would be on in the house again. And uh, she would play it on repeat. Sorry, Peter. Uh, we aren't doing Friday Night Magic, because we're not good enough for that. Um, we did some on Wednesday. You know what's actually good from DC? Well, Vertigo, the Sheriff of Babylon. No, I'll look into it. <laughs> Oh, that felt good. I kind of want you to go back to Superman just for a little bit, only to see if my brother starts singing. Oh, God. Nick, what did you do? Well, Dick, what did you do? Dick, Dick, I love Dick. I'm sure you do. Uh, <laughs> Every time. Oh, try again. I think that's why they never addressed anyone by their first name in the TV show. Songs I like repeatedly and a lot, but like never for months on end. No, you know, it'll, no. At most, it will be a week. Dick, of what are you doing? To one song a lot, mm -hmm. but never like twenty four seven all the time. And I like I was at the babysitter's quite a bit because my mom, you know, worked late and would drop me off early, so I would be there. Just. Wee. Wee. She ruined a lot of things for me. 
I'm sorry. I mean, she also, like, like, I also, like, learned a bunch of stuff that I, I enjoyed while there. Like, I learned I loved video games. And that I was better at it than her sons, which they hated. <laughs> How dare a girl be better than us at something. Yeah. That was exactly it. I, kicked, you, I you, always kicked their butts at GoldenEye. Peter suggests if you want to try country music again. To go. Here's my problem. I like bluegrass music and like anything without the twang. If, it, if there's even a hint of the twang, I'm like, nope, and I have to switch off because I'm like, I, I immediately hate it. Peter, recommendations for country singers who don't have twang. Yeah. The twang is part of country. Yeah, it is. It is now. It is. That's what makes it country and not bluegrass. Oh, God. Taylor Swift also considered? Nope. Nope, not anymore. I mean, she was, and I didn't like her when she was. I, did, I only liked her when she started going off of the country. She was hitting the country pretty hard there for a while. Bluegrass, <laughs> I, I do like some bluegrass, but remember, bluegrass does not have the twang. Nope. Like, for real, the, the twang. Ugh. The twang. It haunts me. The twang. <laughs> I do like the Dixie Chicks. To a point. A point. <laughs> but they're, they're more on like the the, the rock side. Stuff. She only made breakup songs anyway. P Swift is not country. She just, she's just breakup songs. So she's the cure. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. Is that not accurate? Remember how I was telling you about the guy that, that only liked progressive music and then really only liked Pink Floyd and the Beatles? And I'm like, Does he like idiot. The Cure? Well, no, I think he liked The Cure too, but it was like, <laughs> Peter, listen to this. What song comes to your mind other than it's Superman song? Uh, I want to know uh, 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 if you and I are on the same wavelength. Uh, <laughs> Accurate. Uh, da, 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 da. Da 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 da. Like only da, likes progressive, da, 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 and then da, only da, likes like three bands da, da, out of all progressive. A boring person. Okay, Peter. So, nope, da, da, da. he is not on the oh, same wavelength. Uh, the music might not be hot, loud enough. Let's do this real quick. Da, da. Oh, that's why. So there was no music from the concert. No, I had accidentally shut the music off. Loud. Will it's be now. Loud. I just cranked it all the way up so we could hear it. Oh, you need the flash for that. Okay, well, can't hear a song. You'll hear it in a moment. Fixed it. Oh, yeah. Look at me. Okay, okay. Superman. Here we go. Brother, listen, I want to know if he and I are still on Because usually, when we start spouting movie lines, we can go through a whole theme just going back and forth. I'm sorry, but that's... <gasps> Hogwarts! I know it's not. Let's go! But... Darkham. I'm like, it kind of looks like Hogwarts. Nothing. He's... Alright, well, never mind then. We can turn off the... the... Okay. Music. Bye, dear. 37. Nope. Uh, we have about 15 more minutes of this. Okay. Uh, I'm going to turn the volume down a bit. There we go. Yeah. Wayne Enterprises. The Wayne Enterprises. Well, there's the your boyfriend's building, Clark. <laughs> He's going to go right in his boyfriend's hole. <laughs> right in his Y hole. You don't have John Williams as the man in your head now, Peter? Just your voice. But not my brother. <laughs> well, let me go in his Y hole. <laughs> why? Why would you stop this? <coughs> Their love is beautiful, DC. <laughs> because that looks like it is lights. Oh, they are, they're, they're lights and a fan. No. It's lights and a fan. Damn it. Got a shingle. 
Jingle. Your mic oh. turn turns really? it turns off and no one is talking, so no one can hear the music if you're being quiet. Oh, oh. shit. Well Well wait, but we had the music coming in through a second audio feed. At least we were supposed to. Uh da, 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 da. Please hold. Yeah, they should be all coming in on the same thing. Oh, except that one is cranked, for some reason, down to 2%. Should be a little bit higher than that. There we go. <laughs> Mikel aggressively sing. <laughs> hey, I had to sing a whole concert of opera. I know. So, high five. Yeah. You can you can be my George uh, Street is classic country. Bah, bah, bah. She's bah, not bah, interested, bah, bah, Peter. Bah, bah, I don't really bah, bah, like classic. Like I don't I Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Conway Twitty. <laughs> I'm gonna punch you in the face! Please I keep no. threatening and it, and and nothing happens. Please no. I know. I've threatened it him will, a lot today. It will all be okay. It'll all be okay. Just, I just want to listen to me. <laughs> That's all I want. Here we go. Oh, I like metal, Peter, you guys. Peter found me a new... Is it Screamo metal, Peter? I hate Screamo. No, but this is actually very good. Oh, it's good Screamo metal? Yeah. That's rare. It's, hey, a, it's, a, like it's a band called I Prevail. Jakey Graves is awesome. does country that doesn't sound like modern country. It sounds like live country from before it was popular enough to have converts. Hey, look! It's Poison Ivy! Out of range. Sinestro. The nicer. Brad Paisley is lyrically funny Left in some of his lesser known stuff. Wait, was he the one that did, um... He's the one who sang alcohol. Oh. You beer. Like, yeah, li like, I can appreciate funny lyrics, but, like, if it's paired with, like, my brain just kind of goes, no. <laughs> so I do, like, hello, Mada, hello. That's Mada. not country music. Yeah, it's true. Hello, Fada. Here I am at Camp Granada. Camp is very entertaining. I need to find the lyrics for that. <laughs> <laughs> and they'll say we'll have some fun if oh, it yeah, stops raining. Right there. There's Sinestro. Sinestro! Do you need to be Green Lantern in order to beat him? Nope. Yes, this is Earth and it is ours. You cannot have it. Fuck it. <laughs> I love how his costume kind of goes straight down to his dick. <laughs> it tells you where to point your attention. <clears throat> Not freezing him, Superman. Just melt his fucking head off. That's the plan. Hit him. <laughs> Don't kill Batman. What was that? Kill Batman. No, do not. <laughs> do Don't, not. That's kill domestic. Batman and give him donuts. <laughs> that's domestic abuse. No. Clark. Uh, Clark, that's domestic abuse. You can't do that. Wait, can Sinestro manipulate the green bricks? Because oh, that no. would seem wrong. Let's find out. Let's go find us some green bricks. Or can he only manipulate yellow stuff? Dude, that would be smart. But he's a bonus character. So I don't think they put that much thought into him. That's lame. They need to put thought into people. I guess so. There's always cash. Cash. Johnny Cash. Oh, I thought they just mm. meant get them to pay you to listen. No, Peter is I, stuck in a rut about I'm on country the fence. music. I'm, I'm on the fence about Johnny Cash. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I wanna like him. I wanna nope, like him. Nope, he cannot build shit out of green. Awesome. I wanna like him real bad, but... And there's some of his stuff that... Nice, but my brain is like... Mm -hmm. <laughs> country... Okay, no more country song or, uh, country singers, Peter. Also Willie Nelson. Ugh, I'm tired. No. I almost said country songers. <gasps> country songers. No more country songers. <laughs> I am tired. I love you so much. <laughs> He's besties with Snoop Dogg, too. 
Oh, Willie Nelson? Yeah. Yeah. Like, as a person. Mime Mime goon. goon! Who who has the mimes? Goons. Uh, the Joker. Hey! Because it's funny. Funny to beat them up. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm like... Funny that they can't talk? Oh, oh, can we find the Mad Hatter? Is he in this game? Uh, no, Riddler is. Mm. Mad Hatter was one of my- Riddle me this, riddle me that. I will say though, <coughs> speaking of the Riddler- Bless you. Oh, thank you. I, I will say the best person I think who played the Riddler, at least in terms of live action stuff, yeah. is like Jim the, Carrey. There's been three people who did it, so. Jim Carrey. I beat up my own goons. <laughs> I'll kick anyone's ass. <laughs> I'll kick your ass. I'll kick his ass. I'll kick my own goons' ass. <laughs> kick your mom's ass. Easy Top is good classic rock. So we need to get Luthor to break those black bricks. But tell you what, I think we should break here. Get ready to switch for Digimans. That sounds good to me. <gasps> so I'm going to steal this car first. <laughs> Run over some people. Oh, this is... Because now it's Grand Theft Auto. I, I am glad yeah. that I arrived here today. For tonight? For <laughs> yes. Digiman? Apparently, Mikella really likes Digimon. Yep. I didn't watch Almost, Pokemon was growing up. I watched Digimon. I watched both. I liked both. I liked both. <laughs> <gasps> you take that back, Skippy. Jim Carrey was a terrible Riddler. He did a Joker performance and masked it as Riddler. Yeah, I've pretty much. I've never seen a single version of Riddler anything like that. <laughs> I liked Jim Carrey's Riddler. Okay, baby. No, uh... <laughs> oh! You want me to kick his ass? I'll kick his ass. I'll get my steel tool boots and come back and kick his ass. She just likes the fifth or sixth season. Fifth or sixth it's season of what? It's the fourth. It's the oh, fourth. Oh, you like the one where they like scan their hands and turn into yes, armor? Yes, because that was awesome. This is nothing like that. I know. Okay. This was season one and two. Mm, I know. Actually, this has nothing they're, to do with any of the seasons. They're, they're all they're all sleeping on my shoulders. Mm -hmm. I'm not I'm sleeping. I'm apparently very comfy. Mm-hmm. I was so about everybody. to lick her. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I didn't do it! <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll be honest. Jim Carrey's Riddler was very much a Joker. It's a good performance. But it's not a Riddler-y performance. Okay. Now, I will say, though... I, I think it was because he and Tommy Lee Jones and, like, two of my favorite actors. Mm. Now, there's Jim one Harry thing that makes those movies... Now, one, I do like that movie. I watched it a lot when I was a little kid. Yeah! It's uh, a fairly decent Batman. It and was. it's got Val Kilmer in it! And the thing oh! that makes it feel so much better mm. is if you watch those two, and you can... The, the two... I want to say they're both Val Kilmers. One Kilmer and one Clooney. Kilmer and Clooney, right? The, the, and you compare them to the Keaton Batmans by accepting that those two are the Batman movies in the universe of the Michael Keaton Batman don't, like, clean Batman, because that's when the suit got bat nipples. <laughs> Activate the bat nipples, Robin. Use your rock. Fucking, and the goddamn Use bat, the bat credit card. card! Yeah. I that's never the leave movie home without that it. they watch in the Tim Burton Batman universe. Okay. So it's a universe within a universe. Okay. It's Batception. Bat nipples! <laughs> okay, so we're gonna be back with significantly fewer bat nipples. Okay. Maybe more cat nipples? I just, I really don't like pronounced no. nipples it is. on dudes. <laughs> like, unless it's a porn. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Like that oh, Aladdin guys. porn that keeps popping up, which we'll talk about in the next stream in about... Eh, mm -hmm. Well, I'd say about five, ten minutes. All right. See you in a bit, dudes. Bye, guys.